out there, but believe it or not, cooler than yesterday. Yeah, believe it or not, you know, still feeling very toasty out there right now with temperatures holding on to the 90s. But in comparison to the last uh, couple of uh, days, well, today feeling a little bit better. Right now, most of us in the uh, low 90s to mid 90s as you get close to the center of the valley, but further north and south into the central and northern portions of the valley. That's really where we're feeling the heat right now with the upper 90s and a few triple digits still lingering up towards the foothills. A mix of 80s and 90s right now as temperatures slowly start to cool down, but around Around the Delta starting to feel that cool down a bit more. Those Delta breezes starting to funnel back in, giving us that cooler ocean air as we look ahead to the evening and you take a look at the 24 hour temperature change. We're down 20 degrees cooler in Fairfield, around six degrees cooler in Sacramento. So finally starting to feel it kick in and it's only going to kick in even more through the rest of tonight and heading into the weekend. As we look at those wind speeds, winds have started to pick up within the last hour. We'll start to notice them a bit more as we get closer to about seven o'clock this evening. Gusts around 20 to 25 miles per hour across portions of the valley as we get further into the evening, right around 30 to 35 miles per hour across portions of the Delta. By the time we head into early tomorrow morning, wind to start to scale back a bit more and that'll stay through the afternoon until late afternoon. Early evening arrives again tomorrow and we've got another set of Delta breezes on the way. So the wind not going anywhere and just enough to give us a much cooler evening out there tonight, letting us open up those windows within our homes and letting that cooler air in that we just didn't get out there last Last night. Temperatures dropping into the 50s late this evening, a few 60s as you get closer to the foothills. But overall, the next couple of days, that dull breeze making a big change for us, putting us into the upper 80s tomorrow, back to the lower 90s as we get closer to Friday and Saturday, but much more mild, especially in comparison to where we were yesterday. Across the valley, many of us back into the upper 80s, low 90s for highs tomorrow, feeling that influence of those delta breezes as we get closer to the evening tomorrow. But overall, as you look towards the valley, many of us going to hold on to to low 90s, upper 80s, into the foothills, back into the mid to upper 80s, and then cooling down a bit more so around the Delta tomorrow with highs only in the upper 70s. Over the next four days, temperatures are going to stay much more mild as we look ahead to the weekend. So if you do have any plans out there with dad on Sunday, you'll have no issues. Plenty of sunshine overhead no matter where you are from the coast, even up towards the mountains. Temperatures holding on to the 70s through this weekend as we get closer to the Sierra into the 80s around the foothills and yes, a few low 90s, but then cooling down even more as we get further into Sunday. Father's Day looking beautiful even around the valley. Temperatures staying in the low 90s and yes, we'll stay there as we finish off the work week. Looking ahead to next week too. Temperatures continue to stay mild, so not a lot to complain about, especially with no triple digits in the forecast over the next seven days. Curtis. All right, Ashley, thank you.